And if you've been to Disney, you might have seen Dole Whip. So it's pineapple and vanilla ice cream and pineapple juice. And I was trying to think of a way to do this recipe, um, but decrease the calories. So I got, it's just two ingredients. I have light coconut milk, about one cup, and then 20 ounces of uh, frozen pineapple. So if you buy Sam's Club or Costco, like really large size of pineapple, it's about four cups. So I had to do that math myself because I bought a, a large bag. Um, they do sell it in 10 ounce frozen bags. So I'm going to add to the food processor here, my pineapple in my uh, light coconut milk. And you can also buy coconut milk in a can, but the one I got is in a, it's self stable when you buy it, but once you open it, you wanna pop that in the fridge. All right, everybody's gonna play together um, in here. Uh, let's see here. Pardon the noise. And then you might want to give it a little scrape periodically. Um, the consistency that you want is, is smooth. Um, you want it completely blended. Depending on the power of your food processor or blender, um, sometimes you got to let this go for a longer period of time. And sometimes it's just not powerful enough. Like I have a little, um, sometimes I use it for demos. It's that little like ninja bullet. Um, and that just didn't have enough gas to blend But There we go. Now you can see it. All right. And then periodically you'll want to just scrape it. Looks like at the bottom it's getting nice and kind of creamy. And this one, the serving size is three quarters of a cup. And you'll just wanna get a nice fun um, container for it. I have these fun little crystal cups. And you know what? If you wanted it chunky, you certainly could. It doesn't have to be completely um, blended. If you're like, you know what? I want a little bit of like, chewiness to it, go for it. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna leave just a tiny bit. Cause I like, I do like a little bit of texture in here. Look at how cute that is. And so if you're having like a little party, everybody can have one. And if you're, if you're making this ahead of time, you could definitely, you know, blend it, put it in the um, freezer, and let it set up a little bit more. It'll be easier to scoop that way. But yeah, it's, uh, let's see, 107 calories for three fourths of a cup. Um, you get a little bit over two grams of fiber and about a gram of protein. 